Stephanie Bashore's hobby is sailing. Whenever she has time, she takes to the water. In sailing, skill and experience count more than muscle power. It's a strategic sport. It's often said that sailing is chess on the water. If you can think strategically, you have a definite advantage. When she's not out navigating her boat, attorney Stephanie and her partners are at the helm of an auditing firm. Today, an internal training course is about to begin. Stephanie Bashore employs 70 people. Whether you have a woman or a man as boss, it's the same thing. Work is different at an interpersonal level. A woman as boss has different perspectives, different views on interpersonal matters than a male boss. Bashore began working for the company when she was a student. Today, she owns 30 percent of it. Initially, the bank was skeptical. When I wanted financing to buy shares here, the bank asked whether my husband could guarantee for me. I said, no, either you do it with me or we don't do it. And we did it. Bashore also puts her energy into working for the Association of German Women Entrepreneurs. Even today, four out of five companies have just men in management. Bashore says women don't lack training so much as contacts. Men simply have a 300-year head start. We first came into executive positions after World War II and have to catch up. Networks are important. We have a project on women in the supervisory boards. One-sixth of supervisory board members are found by headhunters, the rest through old boy networks. And if those networks are all male, no women are recruited. Today, Stephanie Bashore is visiting a client. The two entrepreneurs got to know each other through their association. Bashore's client also heads a mid-sized company. Her car dealership chain has 100 branches and almost 300 employees. Most of those employees are men who have never had a woman as a boss before. As the daughter of the owner, I had big problems getting accepted when I started out. Oddly enough, it was the little things that opened the door for me, like being the fastest in a go-kart race. Then they started recognizing my achievements. But at first, I definitely had greater problems gaining recognition. It's very important for women to have such role models, because women like this are the role models for the next generation. Women can do this just as well. Head of a company, president of an association, and still plenty of energy left over. The Berlin Cathedral Foundation also profits from Stephanie's business competence. She's a dedicated fundraiser for the renovation of the cathedral. Berlin has been my chosen home for 20 years, and I think the cathedral is worth supporting as a cultural treasure. That's why I devote energy to it. And of course, it's also because she's convinced that women should become more visible in all areas of society. <laughs>